All right, now for those who posting photos or videos on any social media platform, please do not forget to use our official hashtag. Our official hashtag for this year's Beanie 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 is Beyond Beauty. Again, hashtag Beyond Beauty. Princess and Jerson de Maldivas stunning creation that tells its own story in every detail and in a ball fabric and this national costume coupled with a stellar performance when Catriona walked the fur or the new frontier theater stage in 2018. The intricate bid work and adorned this costume and the polished veil were only marched by her elegant movements. The result was pure drama at its finest. Now we move on to our next costume. This uh, costume over here. Celebrating the colorful tribes of Davao, the Moros, and the Lumas. This modern turn is striking blue, in striking blue, is highlighted by meticulous beadworks and add, or that adds the uh, tribal feel of the design of Vini Vini Filipina Supranational 2018 Jessa Weller 
Presented a gown with a fan and long metal fingernail accessories during the Not Cause event in 2018. Beautiful and elegant. This creation by Neil Patrick Himani also paid homage to the late Victor Moreno. We now proceed to our next gown, our next costume. This luxurious terno gave Binibini Pilipinas Globe 2018 Michelle Gumabao a powerful, elegant aura. Just like the striking Philippine Eagle, from which the designer Nat Manilag took participation or took inspiration. This serpentina cut black terno with navy blue sequined appliques, butterfly sleeves, and a remarkable headdress designed by Patrick. Isorena allowed Michelle to exude class and sophistication, especially when she executed a flawless 360-degree rotation in one spot during its presentation. And last but not the least, of course, is this, uh, this nice, beautiful costume inspired by the famous hanging rice. This one over here. A popular delicacy from Cebu, this modern interno by designer Philip Tampus is highlighted by the weave work of young coconut leaves. The black color was chosen for a modern and elegant approach, which BB Filipinas Grand International 2018 Eva Patalipo presented in a dramatic fashion during the competition. The lovely uplifting floral embroidery is a loving tribute to the late Pitoy Moreno who loved floral details. Okay, and then we now proceed with the moment you've all been waiting for. After this, of course, this will be open to the public. You may have your photos taken with our pretty lovely babies here. Okay. Okay, ladies, so we again would like to request our first batch to join us here in the front. And now to begin the ribbon cutting ceremony, we would like to call Mrs. Estella Marquez Araneta. Applause, everybody. Oh, yeah, unfortunately, she won't be able to join us in the actual ribbon cutting ceremony, but she's here with us, yeah? Okay, so we'll be doing a mock ribbon cutting lab. Okay, ladies? Okay, hold on. Okay, good news! Madame Stella will be joining us for the ribbon cutting. Ladies, please stand by. We also would like to request Mr. Raymond Saldana and Bini Bini Filipinas 2019 candidates. First batch here in front. Okay. All right. by the Ananeta Center Incorporated, ABS CDN, Mega One, Roll Balance, Golden C, Jack Jeans, VLDT Home Fiber, Manhattan Garden City, Ever Banana, Pizza Hut, Dairy Queen, Taco Bell, Bulletin Airlines, Manila Bulletin, Novotel Manila Ananeta Center, David Salon, Power Tracks Incorporated, Gold's Gym, Picture City, Gail Carnegie, Dogs Rappos, Swimwear, Jojo Bragavis, Raymond Saldano Photography, Equinox Vanilla, and Bruce Casanova Photography. Alright, so again, for those posting photos or videos and any social media platform, Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter, these are not the best news. Our official hashtags. Our first is hashtag Beyond Beauty and hashtag BBBVS2019. Alright, here we go. Once again, a big round of applause. 
for this is Estella Marquez Avaleta, together with Mr. Raymond Saldana, and then of the DVD Filipinas 2019 candidates. Okay, choreographers, please stand by. On my cue. All right, here we go. On three, two, one. Ladies, you may now cut the ribbon. On Stella, go ahead. So, Raymond, please. You may now cut the ribbon. There you go. Another big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. We would like to thank, of course, Mrs. Estella for a kiss. I'd like to thank you so much, ma'am. I go along with uh, Mr. Raymond Santana. Thank you so much, sir. And our first batch of uh, BBB candidates. Okay. 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 To all of our guests, I know you're all excited to go in. Please wait for me to get the view. We'll just have some quick photos with, of course, Sir Raymond Saldana, along with our remaining mini mini Filipinas 2019 candidates. We would like to request our second batch of BBBs to please stand by and uh, Sir Raymond, please stay.
All right, ladies, after you have your photo standing, please proceed now to your photo. Again, for the meeting meetings, is done and having their photos with, of course, our uh, friend here is for Raymond. Please proceed now to where your photo is located. Okay. Thank you so much, ladies. You may now proceed to where your photo is located. Come on, ladies. Please proceed there now. Where is Caraca? Please stay here. Bataca is in La Union. She is here.
should should I use the white pen or the silver? Like the silver, gold pen, like my nails. Wait, where should I sign? Anywhere? Saan maganda? <laughs> Para hindi masira yung picture, di ba? It's so perfect na eh. Here. Uh, it's very na, what if that's not my signature pala na wrong joke? That's it. Thank you. 
inside the Soan meets Mindanao in the Parcellera and this is my Susu <laughs> by Tom's house. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. Yeah.
actually inspired by a figure from Philippine mythology called Princess of Rupas. She's a warrior, she's a leader, and she's well-traveled and multilingual. And I wanted to draw on someone who I think inspired my vision for myself and for modern Filipinas. I'm, as a practitioner of Filipino martial arts, I too am a warrior, I too am a leader. I'm cosmopolitan, but at the same time very Filipina. And so that is why I chose her as my national costume. Thank you guys. Come and enjoy.
weaving and fabric and also pinukbuk which is very popular in Pampanga and the people who made this are the people who are in Aguila City Jail. So I would just like to thank the people behind this national costume for the love and support and also the Amazonas. Thank you, thank you so much. I'm live. I'm live. Wait and see on May 29 and know more about it. 